Hey everybody, welcome to the pack opening pro. Pete's back here again, and this is one of my favorite things, favorite products, kind of accessories to take a look at and review on the channel. And this is the exclusive license NHL 2223 Upper Deck Binder. <laughs> yes, I love this product. We're gonna get into it right now. Uh, I'm gonna rip this sucker off here and take a look at it. Get it out of the bag anyway. Let's get it out of the bag. I love taking a look at these. I I usually store my young gun, my dupe young guns in here, just to let you know. And I'm just gonna take this off. So this is 2223 series one binder. And I'm trying to do this carefully so I don't wanna spoil anything inside. Okay, so this is what you get in the binder. You get one trading card binder built to hold an entire 250 card UD1 base set. Three hot UD1 upper deck one. Series one packs, 24 cards. Look for popular young guns, right cards. So Beneers, Rosie, Boldy, those things. One sophomore sensation card you can't find anywhere else. You know what I'm looking for here, right? Looking for a cool Caulfield. One poster featuring a complete UDO and base set checklist. One trading card collector's guide. So yeah, so let's take a look at this. And this is it. What do you think so far? Like, I really like the uh, the look of this binder. It's really nice looking binder, to be honest with you. I like the color. Uh, that's the same color series one. You know, let's collect the best, right? That's what we do. We collect the best. So let's uh, let's see what we got in there. I'm going to see what's in here first. Yep, so the first one, Software Sensations, I'm going to show that one right away. Just because that's the card I see right away. And it is... Oh, Kent Johnson, um, Software Sensation. Yeah, he's not a bad rookie at all, actually. Columbus Blue Jackets. I wish it was Cole Caulfield, but you know what? Hey, sophomore sensation. Kent Johnson. Nice looking card. Nice looking card. Columbus Blue Jackets. A little disappointing their season this year, but what are you going to do? All right, so we'll put that right there. We'll open it up so I won't get really into the binder. What we're really looking for is these three packs. I've had some decent luck with these packs. So here's the three season series one packs. This is the quick guide to collecting, which is cool. So obviously it's updated with series one, this, all the products for this year for retail. This is a retail one, right? So I've, I've opened all of this on the channel and getting started, start your collection. There's like, you know, tons of stuff you can look at and try to collect in here and popular trading card brands. Of course, the peachy, uh, you know, the nostalgia one, uh, and they keep going, right? So yeah, pretty cool. That's awesome. And then of course you get your massive poster which i do keep this is the checklist which is pretty cool you got all the cool players will we'll be there stam coast pasta you know you'll see uh mcdavid and uh, mckinnon right and that's your complete checklist so yeah it's pretty cool so of course we're going to open these packs and see what we got in it so yeah you know i really like the binders i think they're really cool and they're a great place for me to store secondary either uh, insert cards or dupes mostly of uh, stuff so Let's get it. We get three packs. This cost $20 Canadian. I got it at a brand new local card store that I just found called Casual Games. So I'm um, pretty excited to find one only 10 minutes, 20 minutes from my house. Like that depends on traffic, but it's pretty cool. All right, let's get into this one. Of course, I didn't think I was going to open any more series one. I completely have forgotten about the binders, but yeah, I didn't think I was going to open any more series one on the channel. I still might when they go on sale. Oh, camera. All right, I am not a big fan of the base cards or the writing. I find the text really small, but it makes the picture big. So, Veljamolka, Ryan Donato, looking for a young gun in here, obviously. Roman Yossi, Casey Middlestat, and base packs is what you're going to pretty much get. With I found I get more base packs in Series 1 this year than ever. Killhorn, and yeah, so base pack there. One young gun, so you don't guarantee to get a young gun here, to be honest with you. No guarantee at all, because the one, young guns are one in four on retail. Um, and uh, so, yeah, no no, no guarantee. Trevor Moore. Oh, I got a Dazzler. That's okay. Milan Lucic. Kevin Hayes. And we got Lawson Kraus. And our Dazzler is Anze Kopitar, so our first insert. Well, that's not bad. I like the look of Dazzlers, man. Anthony Mantha, Bushinevich, <laughs> and Tanoff. All right, last chance here to get a young gun. A young gun, getting a young gun would, would make my day. 
getting epic young gun would be even better. But you know what? I, I you know, don't anticipate getting a young gun. I can tell you that right now. All right, so we're working. Therapy. Oh, nope, I thought it was Young Gun Garnet Athways. Oh, we've got a center of attention. Yep, Zabinijad. Great, great center. Nice looking card. Looks like, yeah, it's nice, really nice looking card. I like it. So, no Young Guns, Brodeen, Dolan, Leonard, and Talbot. So, there you go. Uh, pretty cool little product. Like I said, I only ever buy one of these uh, just for. You know, just to have in my collection and to basically storage, to be honest with you. I wish I got a coffee. Field. <laughs> Once again, I'm Pete. Thank you so much for watching. Consider subscribing, liking, and I'll catch you on the next video. Bye.